Right, so we finally arrived in Scotland for our week here. I love this place, I really, really do. And as you've just seen from those few clips this morning, there's a pier just down from where we are staying and we decided to chuck some wetsuits on and jump in. Gotta say, it is a lot colder up here than what it is in Wales. But for what we're gonna be doing now, as you can see these beautiful surroundings, we are gonna go for a bit of a walk. Now, obviously the weather's not the best for us at the moment, but it's warm, but it's just raining at the moment. So what we're gonna do, is over there is Trident. That's the nuclear submarine base where they obviously load all the nuclear missiles and whatnot. Obviously, we can't go and visit the actual nuclear base, otherwise, you know, we might get shot or something. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna stay on this side, we're gonna walk away down and we're gonna try and check it out. But we have got a couple of other places we're going. I've got this one with me as well today. It, it was meant to be, I got a put up with her all the time. She drives me mad, she drives me mad. No, I love her dearly. No, let's see. <laughs> see, we're happy. Right. So what we're going to do is we are going to get going. We're going to get to some walks. We are going to go see what we can see here. And uh, have yeah. a good day. Bye bye. Wow. She's too busy taking a selfie of herself. <laughs> right, we're all the way out here. And the only thing she's concentrating on, right, is taking a picture of herself. Right, anyway, uh, that view you've just seen then, sadly, is about the only view we're going to get of Trident. Now, the idea was, is that you could get down to like, there's like a beach sort of area down there, but everything's crazy overgrown. It's raining. And um, yeah, the trees are really massive here. So don't get really see it as much, but that is Trident. That's where they have all the, the nuclear vessels, submarines that they load up. Well, what we're going to do now is we're going to head back up there and um, where are we going next? I don't, I, don't know. I, I even I don't know. I think we're going to go for lunch. So oh, in, in the next cool. couple of clips, you'll find out where we are. Yeah. Right, so we decided that it's time to have a, a little bite to eat. So we're back, basically back to where we were cliff jumping earlier today. We are going to go in the Blair Moor because my partner is gluten intolerant so we don't really have a lot of options after the time we go to places but this place apparently does a lot of different things and i think she's done to try the mango smoothie something like that Right, okay, after some lovely food, which I've got to say, are very nice, and that carrot cake is sick, honestly. Really nice. This one, she had, what did she, what did she, what did she have? I had nachos with bolognese and cheese. Yeah, she, what kind of bolognese? Vegetarian. She went vegetarian. Now, there's okay. nothing wrong with being vegetarian, oh, but. I'm ready for the day. She, she never is vegetarian. But anyway, so we are now I down. Really oh, shut up. Right. So basically we're down now in uh, the National Park. I was just trying to remember which one it is. I don't know, you've seen it in this thing anyway. So basically we come down here, we are gonna go and hike up through Pucks Glen. Only about a mile, mile and three quarters, pretty easy going. And we are gonna go and check out the waterfalls and whatnot else in the gorge. Hopefully after all this rain, it should be pretty good because um, yeah, the rain has pretty much hampered our plans so far. Because on the drive on the way up, we might have seen some views in the waterfall, but it's absolutely chucking it down so we can get to them. And then today it's raining again as well. So fingers crossed, it should be pretty good. And then if we lose this one on the way, oh, it's been a good day. No. <laughs>
That is the beautiful Pucks Glen. Got to say, it's looking really, really good today, actually, after this rain. So quite worth putting up with the rain for it. Uh, that was most of it. We had to run a little bit short towards the end because for some reason, the light or the flash kept coming on on my phone when I was videoing and it's absolutely sucked the life out of my batteries. So we are going to end it here. So basically all we have to do is just walk back down there, straight back to the car. It's not really much to see, to be honest, apart from woods. So we're going to do this. Then we are going to go home and get some tea, which will be good. And then um, we will be out tomorrow. Tomorrow is going to be another adventure. We're in Scotland for a week, so we've got another six days of having some fun. So see you next time.